So happy to have you here for a midweek edition of the NBA on 2K Sport. Hey, it's an exciting time of year with the playoffs on the horizon. Branch, your teams start changing up their rotations with the postseason in mind? Yeah, I'm not a big fan of that. Of course, seeding is so important in the postseason, but I don't think it's time to start experimenting. It's still about winning games and getting into the best position possible. A look at the starting group for the Pelicans. We've got Zion Williamson. Franz Wagner out there with DeJounte Murray. Then it's Carl Anthony Towns. And it's Durant in at the small forward position. Pass to Lillard. Back to Levine. Now here's Nurkic. Drummond inside. Defended by Wagner. Drummond with the bucket. That's the right play to run. Drummond with the skill and size to make that high percentage attempt. Durant against Butler. Durant's shot is off. Outside Butler. Pass to Lillard. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Shoots from the elbow. And Levine with the basket. On the assist by Lillard. In the mid-range area, the big vertical helps Zach Levine get a clean look no matter who's around. Now here's Murray. A steady force on their offense. Recording around 14 and a half a game. Williamson. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. Back in 2021, Zion Williamson was on a serious hot streak. In 25 consecutive games, he dropped 25 or more points and did it on 50% shooting. Now here's Levine. He's been a big scorer for this offense, averaging around 20 points a game. Williamson misses. And maybe it's the adrenaline talking, but they're one for four to start this game. Need to settle down. Lillard can't get it to go. Well, Zion, when he's on the floor, he has proven he is an efficient player. Others are envious of that. They are, B.A. They're envious of his shot selection and his point total. He stays aggressive because he knows what his team needs for him. Physical play inside the paint all night long. Now here's Lillard. Oh, it's stolen by Towns. Wagner, the pass to Murray. Durant with it. And he's in the books. Now one for two. I'll tell you what. Durant takes a lot of contact inside. Defenders try to muscle him, but it doesn't matter. Hits a three-pointer. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Pass to Wagner. Right wing. Williamson against Nurkic. Williamson passes to Murray. Wagner with a screen. From outside, off the mark. Portland leading. And Levine throws it down. The question for Zach Levine coming in, will he get strong enough? There's your answer. Williamson finds Durant. Back to Williamson. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. A bit undersized. His hops make him a legit small ball four. Now a timeout called by Portland. Sexton's checked in for Portland. And as the season rolls on, let's look at the leaderboard. The best bigs from beyond the arc. Number one, Carl Anthony Towns. Normally a coach wouldn't want to see his big men spending so much time out beyond the arc, but not so with this guy.
ahead. We're approaching about three and a half minutes played in this first quarter. Nurkic to screen on Durant. Here's Butler. Ooh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Well, the great ones make their mark in the playoffs. And Jimmy Butler has certainly done that. Some Herculean performances when the chips were down. At the line for two. Shooting two. The first free throw is good. And granted, last year's playoffs, Jimmy Butler became the first player since Jordan to author multiple 40-point, four-steal games in a single series. Oh, and in 2020, the third player ever to record a 40-point triple-double in the finals. I mean, just legendary stuff. Butler hits them both. The Pelicans were pretty impressive last season, managing to successfully battle their way into the playoffs through a tough play-in tournament. Now here's Williamson over Nurkic. Williamson misses. Not sure if that's the shot you were looking for, but it's a fairly clean look. Almost have to take it. Here's Sexton. Deflected! Lillard against Murray. The three is up. That one doesn't drop. So the Trailblazers will take it the other way. You know, in that play-in, the Pelicans face some serious competition swing. B.A., they defeated the Spurs and the Clippers, which was no easy task. But the Pelicans were ready for the challenge and ended up securing a playoff for Williamson. Unbelievable hang time, giving the crowd its money's worth. Go ahead, Zion. Lillard passes to Butler. Over Towns, here's Drummond. Ball With the playoffs the around the corner, let's see how the West is shaping up. You look at the Trailblazers, they have looked in control all season long. Aren't showing any signs of taking their foot off the gas anytime soon. And of course the Pelicans, they're just one rung below them. Seeing where the Pelicans are, they've been relentless competitors all season long. They've assured themselves of a lot of home games in the postseason, and we'll see if they can capitalize. Now a timeout called by New Orleans. We need you to make some noise for your Blazers. Almost an entire new group here. Bryant, he's checked in for Drummond. Aldridge comes in for Nurkic. Zach Levine, he's checked in for Butler. And it's Curry in for Lillard. And the Pelicans also making a change. Claxton, he's checked in for Durant. Shot clock at six. Murray against Sexton. Murray, no good. And he's frustrated. That's a shot he can make in his sleep. against Levine. Aldridge with a screen on Murray. Here's Levine. And that one hits the back iron. New Orleans has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Wagner outside. Pass to Towns. That one's good. This game is all even. What a beast inside. When Towns gets in tight, he's almost a sure thing. Sexton finds Curry. Back to Sexton. Three-pointer. Zion Williamson grabs the miss. The Pelicans have gone 5 of 12 in this first quarter. Pass to Claxton. 
Here's Towns. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. Aldridge with a screen on Murray. Sexton with it. He's picked up by Williamson. And then Aldridge with the dunk. Smooth off the pick. Aldridge knew he can get an opportunity to finish there. Murray against Sexton. Wagner on the wing. Pass to Murray. Shoots from 14. Here's Williamson. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Williamson's got nine. Their defense just falls apart once the ball goes inside. Timeout called. Portland. And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh. Keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. Drummond's checked in for Portland. Nurkic comes in for Aldridge. Collins, he's checked in for New Orleans. John Wall comes in for Wagner. And it's the Blazers with the ball. Trailing by two. Sexton passes to Curry. Drummond, the screen on wall. Clock at six. Sexton misses. A chance at a two for one. You have to find ways to use the clock to your advantage. Towns passes to Wall. Screen by Claxton to the middle. Howard down after the assist led him to the lane. You can trust Wall to find those openings. He's a talented distributor who wouldn't miss that chance. Williamson against Sexton. And yep, it's good. <laughs> Impressive. I mean, challenging at the rim against length. Just have to love the aggressiveness. And let's forget the height disadvantage. He brings the effort, and he brings the energy. Zion Williamson has been on display for New Orleans. Hunting for opportunities, leading to nine points in the quarter. We'll be right back. Take a look at some hustle stats for New Orleans. The way they've been going after steals in this game, it has been super impressive. They are wreaking havoc right now. And I've also liked how they've attacked the opposition off of turnovers. I mean, just making them pay for every mistake out there. Okay, on the court right now, second quarter for the Pelicans. We've got Nicholas Claxton. Kevin Durant is out there with Zach Collins. Then it's Edmund Sumner, and it's Wall in at the point guard position. Hart from long range. Pelicans cleared away. Last time they met was in New Orleans. And what a great feeling, ending it the way they did. Just a clutch effort they can build on. Sumner, and so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It's going to go on Andre Drummond. After nine seasons together in Portland, the backcourt duo of Damian Lillard and C.J. McCollum are no longer teammates. C.J. sent to New Orleans. one falls. Boy, that Lillard McCollum combination, Smitty. You think it was time to break them up? You know, I think both were getting a little older. Defensively, their size were a bit of an issue. But I love this scoring duo. They were incredible, B.A. 
some great memories in Rip City for Dame and CJ. Both good from the line that time. Portland trailing here. Lillard outside. Nurkic a screen on wall. Lillard passes to Nurkic, shoots over wall, and Nurkic with the basket on the assist by Lillard. The playmaking skills of Lillard reads defenses so well and recognizes when they've left a teammate uncovered. Ball against Lillard. Ball gets the bucket. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. There's a screen by Nurkic. Hart passes to Drummond. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. And when you're trying to slow down a top score, often the game plan is to get physical. Grant, you would know better than anybody. What's it like in the trenches here? Well, B.A., it's interesting. I mean, it can wear on you. It's a mental challenge. When you're in the trenches trying to slow down a great offensive player, it really becomes a battle of wills. You have to stay focused. You have to be disciplined. And most importantly, you just cannot take a playoff and allow a great player to get going. Smitty, the challenges of being a small market team are very real for the Pelicans. You know it's tough to attract big name talent or get stars willing to invest in your franchise. B.A., but the Pelicans are doing what they can to overcome it. Levine passes to Lillard. And the layup is good off the glass. Lillard's got five. That was a tough finish. But still, the D has to push Lillard further away than that. wall and it falls two for three from the field so far already five lead changes here speaks to how evenly matched these teams have been thus far Levine passes to Lillard three-pointer the shot that time not on target so the Pelicans will take it the other way Sumner on the wing defended by Lillard Ball against Hart, and there's the foul. It's on Zach Levine. That's his first foul for the Trailblazers. Butler comes in for Hart, and Sexton subbed in for Levine. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Ball for three. Nails it from beyond the arc. He's got seven. Shut out in the first quarter. He's heating up now. I like the aggressiveness. Ball against Lillard. Stolen by Collins. Here's Sumner. The three-pointer off the mark. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Well, guys, Jimmy Butler's focus is all on team success. In fact, his agent said whenever he calls Jimmy to congratulate him on personal accolades, like all in the team, for example, Jimmy hangs up in his face before he can finish the sentence. Ryan for Butler, there's only one prize that really matters. Yeah, he's a rare breed, Allie, for sure. Thanks for that. Bryant, he's checked in for Portland. Jones comes in for Yusuf Nurkic. Wagner's checked in for New Orleans. Murray comes in for Sumner. Kicks it out to Brian. Fires for three. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. This is why you're trying to get him as many touches as possible. He's got the deck. Outside Durant. They double-team Durant. The kick out to Wall. Nails it from three. Wall's got three. ten points. His second make from beyond the arc this quarter after hitting none in the first. Jones with a screen on wall. Lillard with the ball. Durant covering. 11 feet out. Rebounded by New Orleans. Claxton's got four rebounds in the game. Bryant finds Butler. Pass to Lillard. And it's Wall with the block. Oh, nicely timed by Wall. Just so gifted with tremendous length at his position. Here's Wagner. That's good. And so Durant with the assist. 
Durant's got three assists tonight. Tremendous offensive execution. Just trying to get as many clean looks as possible. A nice shot by Lillard. They are shooting it well from beyond the arc right now. New Orleans in the lead. And the move that really shook up the NBA world. I mean, Kevin Durant asking and receiving a trade out of Brooklyn. Now, with this team, he makes them a title favorite overnight. Outside Durant. Shot clock at five. From deep. Offensive rebound. And Claxton gets the bucket. And the Pelicans lead by five. That's just staying in the moment, keeping with the current possession. Timeout called, Portland. A year in, a year out, there's one thing we know for certain about the Blazers. They've got some of the best fans in the NBA. Clap it up, fans. Make some noise along with your Blazers breaker dance crew. Switch here. Curry's checked in. And here we can check out the story for Kevin Durant. And he's having issues at the free throw line at the moment. In the past 10 games, his touch hasn't been the same as it was before. He'll be trying to correct that tonight. Sexton. He's been an offensive weapon for them, scoring around 17 and a half points a game. To the inside. And it's going to be out of bounds. Portland will have another go. Over the course of the last month, here are the NBA's best free throw shooting teams. The Trailblazers, third. And looking at last month, this team really got it done from a charity strike. Whenever you foul them, they made sure to make you pay for that mistake. Just five on the clock. Here's Butler. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. You love how fearless Butler can be. Charging through contact to get his shot. Here's Durant. Man, Blazers fans have been having a bit of whiplash. Western Conference Finals to the lottery in just three years. BA injuries had a big part to play in that shows how fast the NBA landscape can change. Fans are hoping they can get back to what they were just as quickly. And the first one at the line is good. A multiple-time champion in this league. When Kevin Durant is healthy, he's a true force. Zach Levine, he's checked in for Portland. Damian Lillard comes in for Sexton. Towns, he's checked in for New Orleans. Williamson comes in for Wall. And both free throws good for Durant. Yeah, they, they're really cashing in more at the line here in the second quarter. Levine passes to Bryant. Now Butler. Bryant a screen on Durant. From 12 feet, Williams grabs the board. The battle of the boards has been something to watch. On the wing, Durant. That's good. And it's Williamson with the assist. Durant's got four points in the quarter. That's a tough shot in traffic. Durant using his size to full advantage. Hits the trifecta. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Murray passes to Durant. 141 left to play in the half. Knocked away. Six to shoot. It's not going to go for him. And it's Portland the other way. And he's having an ugly quarter from the field. It seems really frustrated. Jones sets a screen. And DeJounte Murray is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. So for the Blazers. Andre Drummond is checked in for Bryant. And Yusuf Nurkic is subbed in for Jones. Andre Drummond. 
There's a minute 17 left to play in the first half. Pass to Drummond. Just five to shoot. Levine. The Trailblazers rebound. And the jam by Drummond. A man among boys on the offensive glass. Andre Drummond picks up a lot of extra points this way. Durant against Butler. Shot on the wing. That doesn't go either for Durant. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. Drummond's a screen on Murray. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. And it's good. Credit Levine with the assist. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Up top Durant. Butler covering. Takes the 12-footer and hits it. Durant's got six in the quarter. Known for his shooting ability, Durant is fantastic from their mid-range. Lillard outside. No good from outside. Outside Durant. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. And so it's John Wall making highlights for New Orleans. He put together 10 points in the quarter. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Yusuf Nurkic is out there with Andre Drummond. Then there's Zach Levine. Then there's Damian Lillard. And it's Butler in at the three spot. That's the group in the game for the Trailblazers. Well, Grant, one thing Levine has done since entering the league, he's taken his strength training very seriously. No question. I mean, he can play a much more physical brand of ball now. We even see him post up with his back to the basket, converting through contact. It's just part of his overall evolution. And he makes a first. You know Zach Levine's never averaged fewer than double-digit points in his career, but he didn't get picked for the All-Star team until his seventh season. Both free throws good from Levine. You know, one area where Levine improved in his first All-Star season was efficiency spinning. You're correct. The scoring totals were always impressive, but his effective shooting percentage took a big jump up. Zach's playing the smartest basketball of his career. These teams just keep trading the lead. Yeah, you wonder what it's going to take for someone to pull away. Here's Levine for three. Yes, great play by Lillard to set it up. Lillard's got three assists now in this one. This demonstrates how confident Levine is. Knows he has the trust of his teammates to fire quick shots. The deep three from Durant. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Lillard outside. And if you're just joining us, we play just over a minute here in the third. The Pelicans trail. Pass to Murray. Williamson outside. Butler against Durant. Back to Williamson. Gets the bucket and the foul. It's going to go on Andre Drummond. And the blend of speed and power, as you said, Grant, Zion is unmatched. He's a rhino with a jetpack. And on defense, when you see him coming in the open floor, you don't want to get in his way. The explosiveness in the paint is really what makes him so efficient. Oh, it's blocked by Towns! The defensive chops of Towns, able to use his length and timing to stifle shooters. Right side, Murray. Pass to Wagner. Now Williamson, defended by Nurkic. Butler against Durant. Butler passes to Levine. Lillard with the ball. Butler on the wing. Back to Lillard. Good, and Butler gets the assist. Lillard's got 17 points. Back-to-back -back threes, making their defense work on the perimeter a bit. 
Butler against Durant. Williamson with a screen on Butler. Durant, pass to Williams. Ah! Wow! Oh! Crazy good! I love how efficient Zion is. Dependable at picking smart shots to take. Time called here. The Trailblazers decide to talk it over. Just over two and a half minutes gone by in the second half. Outside Levine. Fires from deep. Portland again missing. For New Orleans, they've gotten three or four shots to fall so far in the third. Wagner, the pass to Murray. Here's Williamson. Outside Durant. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Williamson. And that comes off the assist by Durant. Durant's got seven assists in the game. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Over to the wing. Aldridge, right side. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. They get it back. The kick out. Curry. Lillard, left side. Goes back up. And the jumper is on the mark. Lillard's got five points now in the quarter. Look how focused Lillard can be. Striking before the D can collapse on him. New Orleans calls timeout. Looking at players with limitless range, Grant. Damian Lillard right at the top of that list. Oh, B.A. And Lillard, he can just make it look so easy. He gets a lot of his strength on his shot from his legs. On the short list for players, you don't mind pulling up from the logo. Now here's Murray. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Here's Williamson. And Aldridge with the block. I mean, showing great anticipation. Aldridge was all over that shot. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Oh, terrific defensive intensity right there. Getting stops like that is crucial for them right now. So for the Blazers, Jones, he's checked in for Aldridge. Butler comes Colin in for Hart, Sexton. and it's Colin Sexton in for Damian Lillard. Six on the shot clock. Bogner outside. Sends it home from three-point land. Bogner's got his second bucket on the night. Look at the unselfishness by Prince. Doesn't have what he wants. Keeps the ball moving. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Zion Williamson. That's his first foul. Second team foul. Sexton against Murray. Outside Sexton. Five to shoot. Here's the screen by Bryant. And shows hustle and plays hard on defense. Wow. Towns sure knows how to keep his coaches happy. Murray against Sexton. Steps back and fires. Murray, no good. Portland has gone 7 of 15 from distance in this game. Bryant, the pass to Butler. Soft touch off the glass. Butler's got six. Wow, the strength of Jimmy Butler fends off defenders well when he goes up to score. Knocks it loose. Oh, it's stolen by Butler. Down low. Curry passes to Sexton. Now Butler. Over Murray. It's wide right. Hits off the rim. That was the best he could do. Just fade a little bit, try and get a clean look. But the defense was right on him. Let's it go from 11. And again, no good by New Orleans. And they're winning despite his poor showing offensively. Some nights, your teammates have to carry you. Sexton misses. Two minutes yeah, two we're not used third. to seeing him get two bottled minutes. up like that. Wow. Back to Wagner. Towns against Butler. Shots good by Towns. He has six. 
the defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Butler with the ball. Towns covering. The shot by Butler. No good. New Orleans has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. And the ball out of play. The Trailblazers will have it. Over the last month, these are the highest scoring teams in the NBA. The Trailblazers, third. This team has really found a great offensive rhythm lately. Running smart plays, sharing the ball, and racking up points. Portland has gone two for five from three since halftime. Curry, a screen on Murray. Sexton passes to Bryant. And then Bryant with the dunk. <laughs> and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. This is a close-knit group. They feed off one another's energy. New Orleans calls timeout. Pelican's ball starts the second half. Let's Here's Wall. For He's got ten. Pass to Claxton. Here's Prince. Left side wall. Picked by Prince. Five on the clock. And the three off target. Let's see if they want to go two for one here, Graham. Hey, looking at the clock, I'd say yes. Got a piece of it. And he gets it back. That puts him in the lead. Sexton's got his second basket of the night. The Pelicans have gotten six of 11 attempts to fall so far in the third. Williamson against Sexton. Oh, and the big finish by Williamson. We talk about Zion strength, but the body control is also elite, especially for a guy his size. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Here's Sexton. No good from 11 feet. Zion Williamson has been on display for the Pelicans. 11 points in the quarter. He's on fire. Back to the game after this break. 55. So for the Pelicans right now, Edmund Sumner is out there with John Wall. Then there's Kevin Durant. Then there's Zach Collins. And it's Claxton in at the five, roaming the paint. This continues to be a battle. The lead is within reach. The direction this game is headed is going to come down to a couple key buckets by either team. Here's Levine. And no good trying to use the glass. Both sides attacking. That was good defense versus good offense. Durant way outside. Oh, he's way off from outside. We all know he's a good shooter. But from that distance, uh, I don't think so. You know, we're seeing players move further and further back to create space. But that does make it a tougher shot. With a tough road ahead, they worked hard to get a good shot. On the wing, Durant. Over Hart. Durant with another miss. And they've been able to maintain this lead despite his inconsistency from the field. Here's Levine for three. Sinks the tray. And the Trailblazers lead by one. Talk about making halftime adjustments. You love what they're doing with him now offensively. Here's Durant. Oh, he finds himself wide open and drills it. Durant's got five points now this quarter. He can break you down solo, but coming off a screen, how are you going to stop KD? Here's Levine. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. First team foul. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Pelicans. It's easy for me. Look at their defensive effort all game. The block total shows their commitment to contesting shots. You also can't ignore the good job they've done rebounding on the offensive end tonight. That hustle has been well rewarded with second chance points. That free throw good from Levine. Zach Levine has so much talent and people just want more. But you can't argue that he produces in so many areas. Damian Lillard's checked in for Sexton. 
So he gets them both. See, now he's getting defenders back on their heels a little bit. Getting to the foul line here in the second half. Pass to Sumner. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Collins outside. Ball for three. Drummond grabs the miss. Drummond's got his seventh rebound here tonight. Nurkic a screen on wall. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Knocks it down from distance. Lillard's got 22. The range of Lillard is endless. You cannot let him get looks from deep. Dane will hit him. Collins outside. Lillard against Wall. And count it. Now five for seven. The lift still there for Wall. Awesome to see him competing, especially when you remember that serious Achilles injury. Drummond, the screen on Wall. For three, here's Lillard. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. The defense is nowhere to be found guarding the three-point shot. New Orleans calls timeout. It was so bad to see Damian Lillard, one of the most durable players of the past decade, to miss so much of the 2021-22 season. Checked in for Drummond. Aldridge comes in for Yusuf Nurkic. And it's Colin Sexton in for Levine. Franz Wagner checked in for New Orleans. DeJounte Murray comes in for Sumner. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Willie Green coaching his team during that last break. He encouraged them to get out in transition. He said, quote, that team can be tough to score on when they set up in the half court. Let's push the ball at every opportunity. Back to you. Okay, good stuff. Thank you, Allie. to Wagner and here's Durant and there's the foul it's on Colin Sexton that's his first foul here's Claxton pass to Wagner six to shoot Back to Claxton. Stolen by Bryant. I don't get it. He was so efficient in the first half. Zero turnovers. But since the break, he's been a disaster. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. Ball to pass to Durant. And it's slammed in by Durant. It's hard to contain KD when he's going for a dunk. He's long and athletic. Lillard outside. Shoots over Wall. That one a little long. For New Orleans, they've gone four of seven from the field in the fourth quarter. When it comes to surveying the floor, Durant's height is a major asset. Portland has gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Aldridge with a screen on wall. Lillard passes to Aldridge. And then Aldridge with the dunk. Oh, and once he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points, moves on. 
Aldridge against Durant. And it's slammed in by Durant. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. Sexton passes to Aldridge. Aldridge with a screen on wall. Back to Aldridge. It counts! And the foul! It goes on Kevin Durant. Understanding the importance of momentum here, LaMarcus takes matters into his own hands. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Trailblazers. They are making it rain from the three-point land right now. And the coaching staff continues to encourage them to let it fly. And also, I just love how they've been moving the ball side to side on the perimeter. Great passing, unlocking their offensive potential. That one misses for Aldrich. You look at the skill, the shooting, the length. But Marcus Aldrich is perfectly suited for today's game. The Trailblazers have gone six for nine here in the fourth quarter. Levine with it. Check by Murray. Baseline try. Shot by Levine. No good. New Orleans has gone only one of four from the perimeter here in this fourth quarter. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. Drummond's checked in for Portland. Yusuf Nurkic comes in for Aldridge. Andre Drummond. Portland leading. Outside Levine. Pass to Lillard. Over Murray. Portland again missing. And for the Pelicans, they're shooting 54% from the field so far in this one. Towns for three. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got six rebounds in the game. Butler passes to Lillard. There's the triple. He drops it from range. Lillard's got 28. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. Pass to Durant. Shot clock at five. Let's it go from deep. Rebound by the Trailblazers. A minute 39 left in the fourth. Butler passes to Lillard. Nurkic is screen on Murray. The three, here's Lillard. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. They're really employing a deep range initiative here in the fourth. And it's working. Interesting approach coming down the stretch. Looking to rack up points in chunks. Here's Durant. And right on target. That one's good. Durant's got 11 points here in the second half. No need to rush here. Take your time. Take your time. This is where you can reset and try to get a good shot. Levine passes to Lillard. Drummond to screen on Murray. The offensive rebound. Second chance effort. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. First personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for your Trailblazers, Andre Drummond. At the line for one. And the free throw, no good. Andre Drummond's games has to improve at the free throw line if he wants to be a go-to player. On the wing, Durant. Let's it go for 14. And a foul Welcome called foul. on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. First personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the Pelicans, Kevin Durant. Take a break. Two Take shots. Breaks. Two shots. He gets the first, and that brings him with an eight.
And both free throws good for Duran. Here's Lillard. I think a bucket here, Grant, would end this game. Absolutely. That would put a bow on this one. Love the aggressiveness of Zach. Hand off right there. Forcing the D's hands once he's this close. At the line for your Trailblazers, Zach Levine. Two shots. And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to go. And he ends up making the second. And that stretches their lead to eight. And the Pelicans call time here. The pass to Williamson. Levine with a steal. From eight feet away, jump shot is good that time. That's an inspired ball club. They fought hard, and during the most important moments, they made big plays. Especially during this last run, which ultimately put the game away. Here's Durant, and he gets the friendly roll as that one goes. One of the all-time scoring greats. Durant is racking up the points tonight. There's nothing you can do to stop him. Now Portland with it. Lillard with the ball. So it's Portland picking up the win.